Hello everyone, in this recording uh, we will try to vectorize uh, polynomial with degree 2 and degree 3. Uh, I have taken four uh, examples, uh, two for uh, quadratic and two for polynomial. Uh, as you know, uh, we will use a quadratic uh, standards uh, uh, coordinate like a here a is 1 b c a b c a is 1 b c d so they'll be used for this i mean, we need to go to the mode uh, for equation and the degree of this polynomial is 2 so we'll use quadratic equation formula 3 a value here before x2 it's nothing is there it means 1 is there enter then negative 6 enter then 8 enter equals we got uh, x is equal to 4 first and then x2 is equal to 2 so I'm writing just xx then take this change the side of uh, the 4 so it will be x minus 4 that will be x minus 2 the second one it is again a quadratic equation uh, sorry expression of polynomial so uh, i'm standing in the quadratic if you if you if you want to see the mode again so 5 and 3 so it's quadratic a value is 1 b value is 1 upon 6 and c value is minus 1 or negative 1 so negative 1 you want to use this fraction form or you want to use direct division would be same meaning uh, okay so the x1 value is 1 by 3 and the x2 value is negative 1 by 3 just change the side for them and remove the equality symbol from the scene and there will be two factors now let's go for the uh, cubic expressions for cubic expressions uh, we need to take equation which is cubic so 4 here a value 1 b value negative 6 c value 11 and d value negative 6 enter we will get 3x value x1 is equal to 1 this one is equal to 3 then equals 2 after writing these values just change the side for 1 and remove equality symbol negative 3 negative 2 and remove the equality symbols from the scene so it will facilitate you in correct maneuvering x3 negative 8 so if you see here it should be in this order ax cube plus bx square plus cx plus t so b is 0 c is 0 we have a value we have d value so a value is uh, okay we are already on if you want to see so equation 5 cubic is under 4 a value is 1 because x cube is given then we don't have x2 we don't have x so for them b and c will be 0 so 0 enter uh, then c is also 0 and for d we have negative 8 so negative negative 8 enter and we'll get x is equal to this which is a real root and uh, this one uh, is uh, uh, imaginary one uh, and another one imaginary one right uh, I mean complex one so if I change uh, the calculator to natural display maybe i will see this cube root mm -hmm. 
let me see yeah so you see uh, if you want if you want to see them uh, in the natural format you need to take uh, the format to the natural display then you will find them okay so if you write them equal then change sign if you are good at algebra and you know multiplications so multiply these two big brackets and we will find them. okay thank you i hope uh, this will give you a window to use uh, the calculate for factorization thank you